Hey kids, Invertical here. Welcome back to How to Survive 2. Uh, we're picking it up kind of just shortly right after the last mission. Uh, we just helped Raymond clear his farm of all his pigs. And now we're going to go see what Kovac has to say for himself. Fine. Now that you. Alright. A whiff of gunpowder. I get 10 boxes of nails. Ooh, nice. Now that you have what you need to make weapons worthy of the name, we'll get down to the serious business. The baseball bats, small bows, and blunt arrows are enough to start off with, as long as there aren't a lot of infected. And they're sluggish. <laughs> you haven't met my pitchfork. <laughs> but what will you do when they come running at you, ten at a time? Oh, I offer them chocolate. Some of them can still run. I just give them chocolate. They'll be fine. They need low on energy anyway. The infection in their nervous system and muscles isn't spreading at the same rate in all of them. What do you expect? They're not all equal, even after death. Oh, you want to test that out? But the good news is, they can't outrun bullets. And that is the exact objective of your next mission. Find what you need to make your own bullets. Sounds like a hoot, right? Uh, I can already do that back at camp. I'll give you a few to start you off, but when you get back, you'll have to make your own. Oh, I've been picking them up out of your armory. I hope you don't mind. I can't do everything for you, can I? Right? You're not saying anything, which must mean you agree. I'm just trying to plot on how many ways I hate you. So, to make your own ammo, you need to find gunpowder, of course. As well as other bits and pieces I'll tell you about. How about like uh, aluminum tubes and lead or silver? The best place to find all that is in any store in town, actually. I love this country. But if I were you, I'd start with the armory on the corner. Oh, well, you're not me. I doubt there's much left in the way of weapons, unfortunately. But maybe the powder kegs escaped the looting. Who knows? That's ah, okay. You can make other things besides gunpowder. You can make cordite. You can make Semtec. You can make uh, plastic, even. I mean, there's a lot of ways you can project projectiles. You don't need gunpowder. Alright, kids. Let's uh, take on this mission to go to town and find some gunpowder, lead pellets, and aluminum tubes. Okay, we're in. We're going to take on Kovac's mission of finding some gunpowder stuff. <clears throat> Once again, just a reminder, this is the edge of my screen. I can see the legs of this zombie over here and not much else. I seem to have pissed him off. See if I can find any of my arrows. There's one. Oh, you're an actual. Oh, you bit me, you little bugger. Ow. Alright, no fair. Lay down, play dead. Good doggy. Let's see if I can recover some of my ammunition. Because I'm down to five arrows. That's not very nice. <clears throat> 
Dude, Zelda's just hand these guys chocolate bars. They're all happy for them. Okay, I saw something over here. We'll pick those up. Hey, dude. Sorry, dude. Nothing personal. Oh. Ow, jerk. Listen, I don't want to dance, okay? You a tic tac. Excuse the zombie hanging his big ass out on the screen there. Something at the table. Which for some reason I can't. There we go. Can you jump over the edge there, dude? onto this balcony. Oh, I must be missing it. What I wouldn't give to be able to rotate camera. So this is a one-way trip. reach him. Anybody else down here that I can shoot at? I can shoot at him, but I don't think I can hit him. Yeah. Well, let's see if that gets anybody's attention. Okay. Oh, 
hey, can I shoot at you? No. And I still can't get him to... Oh, he finally reloaded. Oh, good. I was going to say, I can't get him to reload. Yeah, this is, shouldn't hurt much walking on the fence like that. I can't see if I'm targeting this guy or not. down. Good dog. Zombie. Whatever you were. We just found three of the five gunpowder in one room. Five, four of the five gunpowder in one room. Pistol equipped. Don't lose your head, dude. say about trying to hit me. There's the stairs for this building. Oh, there they are. And I have a fat coming up here to say hello. That's nice. problem with it fighting in close quarters with stuff like that is they can hurt. Okay, I got something else coming up. Sounds like a dog. Oops, I missed a dog. Phone's wire. Oops, miss. 
Lay down. No, thank you. We're not buying any. All right, let's go check out this store here. The copper store. Bits and pieces of lead. That's one of them. Still have to find some lead pellets. Listen, what is the deal about sneaking up on me in the dark like that, huh? Worse than those guys that are trying to sell me newspapers at work all the time. Gunpowder, lid. Okay, we definitely found all the gunpowder. So any more we find is just bonus. We've got the aluminum tubes and another crutch. Hmm. Can't quite get numbers on that guy, eh? Zombies all losing their heads. A fat guy running around here somewhere. Well, I guess they don't exactly run, so. There he is. How's it hanging, dude? 
you go to pieces like that. Oh, I got a zombie following me here. That's funny. Just walking along completely oblivious to it. Still looking for a whole bunch of balls of lead. They give whole new meaning to the term splash damage. Obviously, we've missed a whole whack of stuff in that one corner store there, so we'll have to go back to that. In here, I guess. Is that something? I still hear guys running around in here. Hello? Dead, dead people. Where are you? You, come here. Zombie through window. What is this? All right, let's see if we can find these bits and pieces of lead that we have to find here. Steel break, we'll take that. As this room's full of them. So it's probably upstairs. There's a piece of cloth. We'll take that. Hammer. Yay, we need more hammers. Gunpowder. Tubes. Zombie downstairs. Sorry. Uh, Even 
hungry zombie coming at me. You. Making way too much noise there, dude. Hey, survivor. I see you like picking up everything that's lying around. That's a good idea. You can never have enough junk. But mind you don't overload your backpack, or you'll end up losing agility. And that's a really bad idea in these parts. So remember to regularly transfer bulky items to your trunk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here you are thinking about my junk again there, Kovac. I'm getting a little concerned about you. What it is, is we're picking up these damn hammers. Yeah, goodbye. Dude, that sounds painful. Alright, looks like we pretty much cleaned out the map. So, let's head on back and get our nails. Okay, we're back in. And we'll talk to Smiles and Chuckles here. There you are again, Survivor. Good fishing trip. You'll be able to make your own cartridges in your own armory. Yeah, whatever. I can always Isn't do that. Isn't it a moving experience? A bit like having your first child, but one made of lead. First hamper for barbecue sauce. Maybe a little honey garlic mustard. You know. But, I mean, hey, if lead turns you on... Above all, it'll be critical for what I have to propose to you. <laughs> I can just feel the curiosity oozing out of you. That's not curiosity, dude. <laughs> well, that's not curiosity at all. I'm almost embarrassed at using such tactics. It that's doesn't okay. Matter. I'll let you get fitted up. Come see me when you're ready. Ooh. Baby. I'll go pick up some lube. I'll be right back. So there we have it, Kovac has another little tricky mission up his sleeve for us. And he's completely ignoring my flirtatious advances. I don't know. It's terrible. Yay, a piece of wood. So what we'll do is we'll head back to camp, we'll go fix up some stuff, we'll bring up our gear. I don't think, I think our next mission we have to have a higher camp level for this guy as well. So we'll just check that real quick. Fine. No. Yeah, now I need level 7 for the next mission. So what we'll do is we'll uh, head back to camp and the next mission we'll gear up some gear and... We'll go talk to Raymond, because I think he had something at level 6. And we'll have a little bit of fun. And uh, see what that gets us. So thanks all for watching, kids. And good night for now.